So, how did you come to be in Doctor Who? Aha. Well, the thing is, when you're um, when you start off acting and you have um, so after drama school, uh, they put on lots of plays and you because you want to get an agent and agents come and watch all the end of uh, term plays. And then hopefully you get picked by one. And if not, you can keep going until hopefully you get one. So with once you have an agent, they send you to audition. So you're auditioning for all sorts of things from commercials to plays, to TV, to films, all of it. You're doing all of it. And it was just one of the jobs that um, I was sent up um, to audition for. And I remember, um, they said, yes, it's for this character. It's, you know, it's really unusual. It's Doctor Who. And I remember Doctor Who when I was a kid because I was terrified of the Daleks. So I used to watch um, Doctor Who when I was really little from behind the sofa with my brother sitting there watching it. As soon as the Daleks had come out, I'd be like, oh, screaming. Um, and um, so I remembered it. And I remember thinking at the time, oh, you know, the doc oh, that's a really, it's a really old program. I don't know if anyone's going to be very interested. But I was, I was interested in, in playing the part. It's a new part. And I thought, wow, yes, absolutely. Um, so that's really how it happened. You just, you kind of, it was just one of, one of the jobs that I got sent up for and was lucky enough to, um, to actually, um, yeah, get to be part of it. And it was very, it was probably the most unusual job that I've done definitely it's the first time I've ever had to wear prosthetics and the last it's the only time I've done it um and it was a wild ride and um yeah yeah it was it was interesting indeed a lot of fun